tracking crime where we live. The city of Tallahassee saw 216 shootings in 2022 alone, but efforts are underway to lower that number this year. Law enforcement agencies want people to be more active in their communities, and one way is expanding and joining their neighborhood crime watch programs. That's right. Now at 11, ABC 27's Gabriela Mercurio joins us from Tallahassee. And Gabriela, what is the main message that police are sending tonight? When it comes to keeping crime down or unwanted guests out, in a lot of cases, it can all start by being a good neighbor. It makes me feel very, very safe. Um, I don't go to bed at night worrying about crime. Janice Longordo lives in Highgrove neighborhood off Thomasville Road in Tallahassee. She's lived here for seven years and attributes the safety and protection of her community to having good neighbors. Knock on wood, Highgrove has been pretty fortunate and blessed. We don't have um, a tremendous amount of crime. But again, that has come from good communication. Longordo's neighborhood is part of Leon County Sheriff's Office 30 neighborhood watch programs. Captain Jimmy Goodman says he saw a decrease of about a dozen neighborhood watches after the pandemic and is now pushing for people to get active again to help reduce crime. And we're encouraging people to get back in, get re-engaged with us. We want to be there. We're already there for their service. We want to provide a better one. Here's how it works. Members of law enforcement come into neighborhoods that are interested in starting a program to help establish roles for community members and educate them on what to look out for. That way, if they see a suspicious vehicle, have a package thief, or a speeding problem, they can have a more streamlined communications with officers to report it. Tallahassee Police Department Community Relations Officer David Alford says they have around 200 neighborhood and apartment watch programs throughout the city. He says the program allows them to be in more places at one time. Helps us because it's a uh, force multiplier for the police department because the neighborhood becomes the eyes and ears within the community to tell us when something's not right and to be able to reach out to law enforcement. Longordo says the key to a successful program is getting to know your neighbors and having an open form of communication. It's got to be a group effort. It can't just be the sheriff's department or just the neighborhood. Everybody has to work together and that's the main thing that they've really worked on and done an excellent job with is opening up that communication. Goodman believes as more people get involved, the safer our community will be. Active neighborhood crime watch, crime goes down. People are watching, people are reporting, and we are moving the, the thieves out of that neighborhood. If you're interested in starting a neighborhood watch in your community, you can reach out to TPD if you live inside the city or LCSO if you live outside city limits. Reporting in Tallahassee, Gabriella Mercurio, ABC 27.